Georgia Representative Marjorie Taylor Greene's personal Twitter account has been permanently banned after she repeatedly violated the social network's COVID-19 misinformation policy. Twitter took down Greene's account Sunday after temporarily suspending her on three separate occasions last year, although it's not clear what exactly she posted that warranted their most recent action. Her congressional account, at RepMGT, still remains active. We permanently suspended the account you referenced, Adam Greene, for repeated violations of our COVID-19 misinformation policy, Twitter said in a statement. We've been clear that, for our strike system for this policy, we will permanently suspend accounts for repeated violations of the policy. A rep for Green, 47, tells people that her account was suspended over a thread that claimed more than 18,000 people have died from the COVID-19 vaccine, citing the CDC's Vaccine Adverse Reporting System VAERS, which collects data on anyone who experienced an adverse event after being inoculated, not necessarily because of the vaccine. Note that the inclusion of events in VAERS data does not infer causality, VAERS notes in a disclaimer on their website. Twitter is an enemy to America and can't handle the truth. That's fine, it'll show America we don't need them and it's time to defeat our enemies," Green said in a statement. Twitter implemented their COVID-19 misleading information policy last March, with five or more violations resulting in a permanent suspension. Although a single strike will not incur action, the site locks accounts that repeatedly violate the policy. Green received a seven-day suspension in August after tweeting that the U.S. Food and Drug Administration should not approve the COVID vaccines, which she claimed are failing. The Georgia Republican was previously blocked from tweeting for 12 hours in July after she posted that COVID-19 is not dangerous for non-obese people and those under 65 and compared the vaccine rollout to human experimentation. She also faced an unrelated Twitter suspension in January for platforming debunked theories about voter fraud in the presidential election. Green, who has amassed nearly $50,000 in fines for not wearing a face mask on the House floor since taking office last January, previously became known for perpetuating baseless conspiracy theories on social media, including the far-right QAnon claims, 